All right, day six. Oh. These things are difficult. Okay, here we go. My husband says they're done so that it's fun to find the number. I just find it annoying. So, day six. We gotta like things in order, so. <clears throat> Cherry blossom matcha. Ooh. And I've given up today, I'm doing a which one. All right, and I prepped 165 water this time around, so it's a bit cooler than the suggested. Let's see, start with half a sample. Almost like last time, there's not that much in the sample. Put the bowl, tear. See if we can get the six. Alright. Oh yeah. Floral and fruity and vegetal. It's definitely a spring. It smells like spring. And I think there's about half a sample left. So I've got six in the bowl. Let's add some water. It's a little clumpy, not as bad as the yuzu was, but I sort of wonder if I should get a sifter. I know some people get sifters. I'm just usually lazy and want to be lazy, but. got like big sifters. I don't think I have any teeny tiny ones. If you're wondering what I'm doing. I'm trying to get a nice froth going. It's not circular. It's not back and forth. It's more like a letter W N type situation. Ah, okay. And then I have the little uh, butt plug-esque thing. My husband's not the only husband to wonder why I got a weird butt plug. All right. Again, fruity, floral, vegetal, springtime. Taste is sweet and then floral. And vegetal and like a hint of bitter. <clears throat> Nothing like the other ones. So I definitely think 165 is better. Mm. I don't think I'm going to add milk or anything to this. I think the flavor is subtle enough. I would lose <coughs> the light flavors if I turned it into a latte. So I like this one. I feel like I have had this one before and bought it and liked it. And I still like it. <laughs>